Alrighty, what's happening people? Back at you with the cereal review, seeing what Weetabix are at these days. So Weetabix chocolate melts, these are little Weetabix things uh, filled with chocolate. Um, so they're going for it, uh, they're going for a bad boy cereal. Uh, this has got high fibre, low in salt, whole grain, fortified vitamins and iron as well. There are vitamins and iron in it. So you'll be flying it on them uh, for the health nuts. Right, so we'll get into them fairly quick. I'll run through the equipment here quickly with you that I'm using. Very important if you're going to re review a cereal that you're using the right stuff. So decanting here, I've got my milk. Um, I've got it in a kind of coloury glass for presentation reasons. Hope you enjoy. That's the milk chalice. And then I've got my uh, palate cleanser here, which is um, a very delicious uh, My Wadi. I've got My Wadi orange and pineapple here. That's the best one. Um, if you disagree with me on that, you can leave it in the comments, but you'll only really be making a fool of yourself, because I'm clearly right. So let's get into these. Uh, 450 for 360 grams. Uh, personally, I think you're taking the absolute piss with that way to Bix, but listen, that's the economy we live in. These will want to be very fucking good, though, for you to be asking them kind of numbers. Oh, these are funny looking. So they actually do look like fucking weird kind of way to Bix. So I'm going to do a little dry test. Oh, fuck, I didn't tell you about the ball. Right, so the ball... Uh, it's kind of a wide open bowl, like a, a kind of a shallow, wide one. Um, I find this lets the aromas in my nose easier. So let's pour that. I like to use a 30 degree pouring angle. This helps me keep the maximum control. I don't want to get too crazy. Only going to have a small few in there now because I'm a fat cunt. And to be honest with you, I'll probably binge eat a load of them off camera while I think about my life. Just get a spoon here as well. Right, so we'll get into it now. So I'm going to pour, see how it incorporates here. So uh, I'll show you the pour. Lovely, they're taking the milk well. I'm spilling a bit of milk on the counter, that's alright, I'll clean that up after. So there they are there. I'm going to leave them a minute just to see how they take the milk, do they get soggy, and I'll do a dry taste as well. Okay, so here's the dry taste. Oh, very weird texture. A lot drier than a Crave, if you've had Crave. Kind of bland also, to be honest. Very Weetabicky, Palacans. Right, and we're ready to get into the wet test here. So these have been soaking just, just for a couple of seconds. So, so this is kind of, there should be a bit of crunch left in these, but let's say how they take the milk. I feel like these need a bit of milk. They're very dry with the dry test. So let's get into it. Lovely maintain firmness. Palate cleanse. Can really notice the aromas out of the shallow bowl. I'll have one more. Um, yeah, bland enough, sort of a worse crave, not worth uh, 450, they're having a laugh. 